damn dump rubbish where you like. I'm just giving the bus tidy, so. So you think that the people who live around here are happy having rubbish dumped everywhere, do you? Okay, so I'll burn it. Burn <laughs> it? Yeah. You can't see it, can you? All right, where are we? Welcome to sunny Murphy Tidville. Oh, what time did we get here then? About two o'clock in the morning. I'll have the continental breakfast with a freshly squeezed orange juice, coffee, and uh, oh, two rounds of toast. Thank you. No champagne, lover. Tea and cornflakes, if somebody can find the sugar. Hey, what's all that rubbish doing there? I, I, I'm just putting it in a nice, tidy little pile before disposing of it properly, see? Yeah, well, make sure you do that. What's the plan for today? Well, I thought we'd hit town. She was sort of place Merthyr is. Well, we need a few things anyway. Yeah, like a new pair of shoes for Reese. Why? Come off it, Reese. When your feet are next to the heater on that bus, we can hardly breathe upstairs. Uh-huh. So it's working, then? <laughs> well, it's true, Reese. Your feet stink. Look, Sarah, why don't you go and get the sugar so we can all have some breakfast, then we'll discuss my feet, all right? Oh, I'll go. I'm starving. Yes, 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 yes. goes out. I do, sometimes. And then I get strapped and no pay. From what I earn, I only see sixpence a week and Dad gets the rest. Two shillings is 24 pence. Do you know that? I've got five brothers. How many brothers have you got? We all work here. Here? Where is here? The Kifar, the mine, stupid. down the pit and died on the spot. Yeah. And Mary Price fell asleep while mine did not air door. And a cart went over her and broke both her legs. You mustn't fall asleep. You mustn't steal either. If you steal, God says you'll burn. My brother got burned in the ironworks. If you steal, you'll end up in China. Man on, Mr. Sugar. Man on. You'll end up in China. Give us a penny, miss. In China. Just a penny. In China. We can buy some shoes. I'm a scab. I thought you in the cobble. Please, miss. That's mine. China. You don't know nothing, do you? China's here in Murphy. You don't want to be caught up in China. Not if you don't know nothing about China. Yes, but China's in. Hey, that's my coin. What coin? I ain't got a coin. But that's how it is round here. Gotta keep your eyes open. If you don't like it, go. Is this your place? Yeah, it's all mine. David Jenkins, please. China's all mine. 
Me, have you? Come to be one of Schenken's Rodneys, have you? And what can you do? Hmm? Can you beg? Can you cry? Like that? Can you make your leg look so burnt that a gentleman has to give you a florin for your keep? Hmm? Can you eat stale bread, rotten vegetables, drink out of that stinking river over there? Because that's what the rest of us have to do, see? You stupid little fool. She's no good. You're supposed to find things, not people. You're supposed to find a gold watch in a gentleman's pocket. You're supposed to find a shilling in a lady's purse. Stealing. What? Stealing. Stealing? My poor David, steal? Never. No, my Rodneys don't steal, do they, Betsy? They, they find things. They're just lucky, see, and observant. Because, you see, if you don't find things, if you're not lucky, if you're not observant, you are dead. Mm. See, Betsy, huh? Now, she found five shillings in a sleeping man's bed last night, didn't you, Betsy? Now, that is luck. He'd had a belly full of rum to help him sleep, right? Perhaps you'd like to go and work with Betsy here in the uh, entertainment business. <laughs> <laughs> or believe me, my girl, if you don't get lucky, if you don't find something, you don't eat. Then you go thin like a stick. And then what will the worms eat when you're dead? Don't get too lucky, mate. You might find the cholera. There's plenty of that going back. You find the cholera. And you'll find yourself in a graveyard. Hey, David, laugh, boy. Find yourself in a graveyard. <laughs> <laughs> When they vanished? Well, I'll tell you one thing, pal. They can do the shopping tomorrow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I thought he said it's a shortcut. Looks more like a dead end. I don't know, Gwyn. Look at this place, huh? Do you know, Gwyn, that millions of people used to work here in Merthyr? Hmm? Millions of them. They came from all over Wales, right? And they all found jobs. Must have been fantastic. All right, now look at it. I don't like cemeteries. They give me the creeps. People are dying to get you, man. <laughs> David Jenkins died of cholera, 1849. One night and day, I bore great pain. 
to try for cure was all in vain. But God knew what to me was best, did ease my pain and give me rest. Died of cholera. Cranky Moses. Hey, look at this one, is. Hmm? Here lies Mary Brown, aged eight. Killed in an accident, Kavartha Colliery, 1842. It's eight. Oh, Mary Brown. There. Mary Brown. That's my name. Aged eight. I know the A, and the B, and the B and the A, aged eight. Is that what it says? Don't you ever go to school, Mary Brown, aged eight? Sunday school, sometimes. I try to make the letters out, but I can't. I hate the mine. The light hurts your eyes when you go out. I'd like the daylight work. Do you have to work at all? A man came to see us. Us children in the mine, asking things. Who's God? How long have we been here? Where's London? They say they might stop us working, but they can't. Everyone has to work. Philip Davis, age 10. I've been below ground for three years. I work 12 hours a day. Everyone and runs. I think I may choose all. Elizabeth Williams, age 9. I work underground for six or eight hours a day. Lots of girls work here. I don't like Nine them. months ago, I was burnt by fire damp. It hurt me badly. It took the skin off I my come face. Here at six in the morning and leave at six at night. The mine's wet and dirty, and my feet are always wet. But I'm used to it. Sarah Davis. Moses Williams, seven years old. Seven years old. The work is very hard. It's very hard, and I often got hurt. The mine is wet, very wet. And I don't like it much. Crushing my insides. 18 years old. Susan Reese. Pain is great. Years old. And still continues. Don't you ever have time to play? What? Play. What you do after? After? Fetch water and clean house. There are men here who are wicked. They swear and drink at night. They breathe funny and spit. They die early. I don't want to die early. I don't want to die here. Oh, Mary Brown, aged eight. Will you stay with me? We could talk and learn letters. I could learn Mary Brown, aged eight. You'd be here. Then it wouldn't matter if my light went out, would it? Will you? symbols there's a P. But under which one is it? That's the problem, see? And if you can guess correctly, well, I might just see a way of giving you this coin back. Hmm? Well, which one is it? We haven't got all day, see? That's one. <laughs> oh, what a shame. What a shame. That's twice you've lost that coin of yours now, isn't it? It's still, it's a living, Betsy Brown, isn't it? If only you'd chosen one of the others. But I saw you put a pea into one of those. Ah, oh, you did, eh? Where's the pea, Betsy? Under your thumbnail, Shankin. Under my thumbnail, see? I told you before, you could land up in big trouble with that tongue. It stinks in here. It stinks everywhere. There isn't a single drop of water here that hasn't been drunk twice already. Not a single breath that hasn't been breathed already. 
You're in China. Uh, now listen to her. She's the Empress of China, she is. And you see. And I'm the Empress, eh? Look out there. Can you see the rats? Can you see the women queuing for water? Can you see the smell? You can see it, can't you, the smell? But we live in it, see? having a party in Big Hall. John Williams says they spent £700 in that castle on doorknobs. £700? Half my Rodneys would kill for a guinea, see? For half a guinea. Hey, Betsy. Jack Jones was given two years hard labour for stealing a loaf of bread. Do you know what he did? He threw his shoes at the judge. Still! It's good news for us, Betsy Vach. All those big knobs up there drinking fine wine. Because soon all their houses will be empty, won't they? Not for long, mind. They'll be full of my little Rodneys, then. Squeezing through every crack in every wall. Stealing. Finding! Just finding! It's amazing what you can find. Are you gonna come with us, or are you gonna stay here to rot? Be lucky. That's the Gifarthur Castle, where he lives, the master. My name is William Crawshay. I am the Iron King. Mirtha is all mine. Come on. Come and work for me. So we're back. Do you have any stay, dear? Yeah. <sighs> yes, we've had a tidy up. Yes, I've disposed of the rubbish thoughtfully. Yes, we've done the shopping. No, I did not buy new shoes. And yes, the heater is on. Good. You have a good look around? Yeah. Well, we've been everywhere. 
seen everything there is to be seen round here. Hey, Sarah. What time do you call this, my girl? Oh. Well, like I said, we've seen everything to be seen round here. This even took me on a guided tour of a cemetery. It's depressing, really. Here lies Mary Brown. Poor girl. She was only eight. Here lies David Jenkins. Died of cholera. Can you believe that? He was only 11. Poor kid. <laughs> <laughs> 